Hello people, how are you? My name's Kev, this is Angling and Anxiety. It's all about the angling, it's just about the anxiety. So, back to the duckweed river. Couldn't resist myself. Gonna try and bag myself a carp. Um, slightly changed tactics on the bait. I've gone for pop-up today. Uh, bought myself some monster uh, monster baits pop-up. All of them when I come home the other day. Turned up last night, happy days. Um, trying them out. Gonna see how we get on with them. I'm desperate to get another river carp out this season. Gotta keep having a go at it. Even if I can catch a tench or a bream, that's a reasonable size, I'd be happy today. Um, I mean, the carp's what I'm here for. There's no telling lies, but fish is a fish, and uh, there's some really beautiful fish in this river. So let's have a get a nice one. Unit. Okay, I'm gonna go. Lovely little bream here. Um, biggest bream I've ever caught, so. Quite happy with it, to be honest with you. Um, so yeah, just going to show you. It's not the carp. It's a bit annoying because I put the carp off now, but I'm not too fast. I like a broom, especially this one. Put up a good fight. It really did. Oh, good old dinner plate, mate. Monster bro. That wakes you up in the morning. But yeah, some people don't like them. I'm not overly keen on them when I'm carp fishing, but you can't complain about a fish like that. It's a specimen at the end of the day. Um, so yeah. So, oh, lovely little bream there. Happy with that. Nine pound three ounces that one, so buzzing. Um, biggest bream I've ever caught. Spot my baits over today. I'm still using the sticky of the bag, um, but I've gone for a pop up because I did catch my last carp and pop up, and I've been fishing wafters down there because I'm so used to fishing lakes. Um, but pop ups definitely work better on the river, I find. Um, Nick always does well when I pop ups, so just built myself some monster baits for beast. They're on a washed out pink, washed outs usually do well, and some washed out monster ice. I've heard a lot about these monster ices. Um, they turned out yesterday night, funny enough. I wasn't too sure I was going to have them in time, but they arrived, so happy days. Um, going to whack these out, see if I can get a carp out. Had a bream, see if we can get a carp. Also, as you might notice, I'm out in the wilderness. I'm not in a bivvy. Um, it's an absolute mission to get here, like, it's too long, do you know what I mean? If I'm doing a night, I'm going to do 24 hours or whatever. Me and Nick do our little 48s between us. Um, it's worth doing, but otherwise it's too much hard work carrying everything over the fields and stuff. So just travelling light today. Got me um, under and cradle rods, everything's all compact. The only thing I do bring with me is slightly heavy is my power pack. That's it. Apart from that, it's pretty lightweight. I love just being out here, just in the wilderness. I was thinking that was behind me. Where am I? <laughs> so, three o'clock in the afternoon. Just woke up from a little nap. No fish waking me up, unfortunately, but it's what it is, still time. <coughs> I'm gonna stay out till about Seven or eight o'clock, something like that. I don't know, I ain't decided. See how I feel. But, um, yeah, nothing yet. 
So fingers crossed we can pull one in. Just not a brain. <laughs> so no carp today. Um, just wrapping up in a minute. Just thought I'd do my last little end bit. Um, leave the rods till last and all that. You never know your luck in the last second. Um, it's not been a wasted day. I've had my personal best bream, so happy days with that. Um, I believe that, that was my partner's granddad who's wished that on me. Every We buried him a year ago today, and the day after he got buried, I think it was, it might have been the day that he died actually last, last year, um, I caught my personal best carp. So he's definitely watching over. He was a keen fisherman himself. Um, brilliant salmon fisherman, actually taught me how to fly fish. Never got the chance to go out with him. Um, but he taught me in his garden, so <laughs> that's something I'll never never forget and I've learnt. So top man for that, RIP William Council out there. Um, this is dedicated to you mate and thank you for the bream. But yeah, unless I catch a carp in the next sort of 5-10 minutes, I'm done for the day. Um, I've had enough. I've got a new phone I need to go and pick up and I'm starting to get hungry, so I'm going to make my way home. Happy days, thanks for watching, all of you watching and all the people subscribing and general good feedback I've had off of everyone, um, strangers to close friends, it means the world, it's boosting my confidence, um, it's giving me something to do which is channeling my ADHD which is brilliant, um, so yeah happy days, thanks for everyone who cares and for those who don't, don't really care mate to be honest with you, happy days, happy fishing, I'll be back soon, I'm not too sure where I'm going to go fishing. Um, thinking about going to do a bit of sea fishing with cart rods. Um, I work on the coast every day, so I thought I might as well kill two birds with one stone and try and get down there after work and see if I can fish off of Ramsgate Harbour. Um, so yeah, we'll see how we get on. Might see a carp after this. Probably not. Speak to you soon. Thanks very much. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Kirsty, thanks. <laughs>